guys. Hey, you ever heard of that band Nirvana? I'm like, yeah, I've heard of that band. I said, well, they're looking for a drummer and they think you're pretty good. Woo! I said, really? Yeah. So I flew up to Seattle. And they already had a drummer, this guy Danny. He was a fucking great drummer. Danny was in a band called Mud Honey, and they've been over here and toured and played a bunch. So the first day I ever hung out with Chris and Kurt and all those guys, we were having a little barbecue. And I said to Danny, I said, I said, what's the biggest audience you've ever played to? And he said, uh, 35,000 people. And I said, where the fuck did Mud Honey play to 35,000 people? And he said, oh, this place called the Reading Festival. It's all right. Yeah. schedule and it said Saturday Reading Festival I think we played at like 2 o'clock in the afternoon or something like that but I'd never been so fucking scared in my entire life but I had to play to 35,000 people that was beyond my Wildest dreams. So tonight, I think there's like a fucking hundred thousand of you. I don't even know how many. Over the years, I've seen the stage get taller and taller, and I've seen the barrier get farther and farther away. From, from right here, it looks the fucking same as it has for 22 years. And for me, to be here tonight with my mother, You know, in 1992, when Nirvana played here, the last show we ever played in England, it was, I think, the day before my mother's birthday. And the audience sang happy birthday to my mom. Well, her birthday's fucking next week, so here's your chance. You guys hit us here, come on.
tonight is like the most important gig of my life.